the NAACP Image Awards 10 years ago. Uh, and we sort of came up with the idea of sort of a big romantic comedy wedding movie set in a world that you don't often see, which is the world of Martha's Vineyard, the world of the sort of super rich um, African Americans. I wrote up a treatment, pitched it around town, um, pitched it to Arlene Gibbs, who left her executive job and moved to Rome. Six years after we initially had the idea, Arlene emails Glendon and I and says, hey, can I write that movie you pitched to me? Um, put it in screenplay form. So we said, sure, uh, but we would like to be producers on the project. We'll give you notes and, you know, get the script right. And we began strategizing how to put this film together. At the same time, I sent the script to my friend Devon Franklin, who's vice president of Columbia, just to get his thoughts. What do you think about this project? Then he calls me up a month later and he says, um, I have a deal, with, we have a deal with T.D. Jakes, Bishop Jakes. I need to find a movie for them, and I think this movie would work. Because Bishop Jake's team saw the, read the script, we sat down, had a meeting, and everyone saw eye to eye on the direction of how to move forward, and a year later, we were shooting in Nova Scotia. 